Hello students, welcome back. In our continuation session of NCRT question answer solve for chemistry, today we are going to solve class 11 chapter 10 S block elements. Okay, let's start. So let's student begin with question number 1 for S block elements. What are the common physical and chemical features of alkali metals? Next is question number 2. Discuss the general characteristics of guard tradition in properties of alkaline earth metals. Question number 3. Question number 4. 5. Question number 6. Compare the alkali metals and alkaline earth metals with respect to their given three properties. You can see. Next is question number seven. Question number eight. Explain why can alkaline and alkaline earth metals not be obtained by chemical reduction method? The highly reducing agents there. Question number nine. Why are potassium and cesium rather than lithium used in photoelectric cells? So, since I am scrolling it down for you, we just pause the video to write the answers, okay? And don't forget to subscribe my channel. If you have got any kind of queries, about these question answers you just ask me in the comment boxes okay i will give you the answers you can get completely solved answers over here okay in crt completely solved now question number 15 you can see complete solved student question number 16 Okay, next is question number 17. Question number 18. Next is question number 19. This one is a very good question. Okay, because you have to write the structures of BCL2 in paper and solid state. See the difference between these two. The bridging bond between these two. Next is question number 20. Question number 21. Question number 22. Question number 23. Twenty-four. Let's explain the significance of sodium, potassium, and magnesium, and calcium in biological fluids. See the solution. Next is question number twenty-five. So, what happens when type of questions? So, you have to write the reactions, and if it is possible, you write the statement also. Okay, I haven't given it. Okay, next is question number twenty-six. Question number 27. Now, question number 28. Again, other write the balanced equations. So, here it is given write the balanced equation. So, don't have to write the statement. If it is what happens when, you should write the statement. Okay. Question number 29. Next is question number 30. So, MCQ. Question number 31, 32. Now, next is very short answer type questions from question number 1. Mm. 
डेड बर्न प्लास्टर कैल्शियम सल्फेट इज कॉल्ड डेड बर्न प्लास्टर क्विक लाइम यू वॉन्ट नो नाउ दिस अरेंज द फॉलोइंग टाइप ऑफ क्वेश्चन इज आर अनदर इम्पोर्टेंट टाइप ऑफ क्वेश्चन नंबर नाइन इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट फॉर यू ओके फॉर्मूला फिफ्स फ्रॉम सॉल्ट सोडियम सिलिकेट फ्रॉम सिलिका Why alkali metals are soft? What do you mean by the diagonal relationship between the periodic table? It resembles the first element and second period with diagonal situated element, neighboring elements called diagonal relationship. BCl is organic solvent. Actually, it is covalent in nature. That's why it is called organic solvent. It's not organic in nature, but solvent is organic solvent because of its covalent nature. Okay, next seventeen and eighteen. Next is question number nineteen. Twenty one. Soda ash that is sodium carbonate. Next short answer type questions. Question number one. Question number two. Next is question number three. This is the excellent white of questions is to come. Some Fasan's rule is applied over here. It comes from the chemical bonding chapter. Next is question number four. Question number five. Question number six. Subscribe zero for the students. My channel ko so that you can get. the perfect information in perfect time in all videos is a important question for uh, joint entrance examinations also it is to come from this ncert question number 10 now long answer type questions for cbse now uh, so the differences comparisons explain why state why alkali metals show plus one state etc etc it will be different types of questions are will given here you can see the answers from here okay okay next is some of the mcq questions Okay, next question number seven, eight. We are almost done with this video, students. So, don't forget to like this uh, video and comment in my boxes. Okay, now some of the hot questions are there. You can see. Students, hope you understand this point. And. this the last question is very important question why lif is almost insoluble in water whereas lical is soluble in only water but also in acetone so very good important questions okay students so we are done with this video today so have a nice day and goodbye